It's Monday, December 9th, 2013. I'm Addie Robertson, and if you loved SpaghettiOs tweet about Pearl Harbor, just wait till you see what they have planned for Easter. This is 90 Seconds on the Verge. Watch out, Apple TV. Google is rumored to be working on its own set-top box. The device is said to run Android, stream videos from services like Netflix and Hulu, and even play some video games. While Google already has the $35 Chromecast, which streams a few services, a Nexus set-top box running Android would be in a totally different category. Sometimes you just can't trust a level 37 Blood Elf Death Knight. According to new documents leaked by Edward Snowden, spies from multiple American and British agencies created World of Warcraft characters to snoop on gamers. It was big enough that a, quote, deconfliction group was set up to avoid agents spying on one another. All this comes as Apple, Google, Microsoft, and others launch a national campaign today pushing for NSA reform. Finally, something they can all agree on. The 2008 document predates the iPhone App Store and the prolific rise of smartphones games. So keep that in mind next time you receive Snapchats from Totally Not a Spy 83. And finally, it looks like Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull will not be Indy's last adventure. Thank God. Disney and Paramount have struck a deal that will give both distribution and marketing rights of any new films to Disney, while Paramount will retain rights to the first four Indiana Jones movies. There's still no word yet on if a fifth movie is in the works, but Disney has been more than eager to take advantage of Lucasfilm's top property. And here's to hoping they don't nuke the fridge in the next film. And that's it for today's top stories. Coming up tomorrow, radioactive wrapping paper. See how you can make your child a superhero this Christmas.